It is the highly anticipated summer blockbuster that is out this Friday, bringing together two of Marvel's biggest names, Deadpool and Wolverine. Hi, Peanut. I'm gonna need you to come with me right now. Look, lady, I'm not interested. All right, well, I'm sort of on the tick tick, so upsy daisy. Many questions loom over the third installment of the Deadpool franchise, including what Logan did, who will be showing up on screen, and who is behind the lady pool mask? There's so many questions. Let's see if we can get some of those answered. Joining me this morning in the Your Morning Kitchen is Deadpool and Wolverine director Sean Levy. Hello. How are you? I'm great. I'm happy to be here. I know. Aren't you happy? Because look at this spread. I know. I show up for work and I get to eat. I know. So it's our favorite thing to do be on this show. Fantastic. Okay, we are going to do things a little bit differently today. Okay. We're not going to do like a sit down interview because we want to eat. We love eating, Sean. We're going to keep it loose. We're going to keep it loose. Okay. But I have to ask you about speaking of loose. Yeah. Okay, you know where I'm going to go with I this? I think I do. Because I understand that you had a nickname from your family, and you do. And I have to ask you about this, because they call you Loose Lips Levy. Yeah, and, and I love that it's now so public. Well, it, That my is, private shame is, is now right. known to all. Hi, Canada. Okay, well, why why is your family naming you this? Because I got a big mouth. You got a big um, mouth. I'm, I really struggle with secrecy. Yeah. I'm that brother or son or spouse or dad who, when someone says, now I'm going to tell you something, don't tell anyone, okay. I'm definitely telling. Okay, so, but this is, this is a problem when it comes to Marvel movies, right? Like, and we have to keep it locked down. We got to keep plot locked down. Yes. People locked down. Yeah. How difficult was that to train your body to do? Uh, it's been a torment. <laughs> it's been a low grade torture for like two and a half years while I've been working on this. But finally the movie is coming out and I'm not only excited to share it with the world, but I can finally stop walking around as a physical spoiler risk. A spoiler risk. Okay. So what we're going to do, because, you know, two of the stars of this movie, Hugh Jackman and Ryan Reynolds, one is Canadian, as we know, Ryan Reynolds. Yes. Hugh Jackman is from Australia. Yes. The Olympics are coming up. So in the spirit of competition, we thought we'd do a bit of a, like a food challenge. I love you it. You know, versus. Are like you into drawn this? drawn with national yes. country lines. That's right. So famous Fantastic. dishes from both countries. You and I will judge which one oh, we I love prefer. It. I love it. Okay. Does this work? Yes. So we're going to start with a classic Canadian dish, the poutine. Mm. Somebody say poutine. Uh, so let's. I, sorry. <gasps> somebody say poutine. Oh, Hello. Hi there. What? I have a poutine what? right here. I actually have with five a tray poutines of poutine. right um, here that I made with my professional executive chef who works here at this show. Uh, and uh, I can't uh, wait to serve it to you, Wide Mouth wait, Willie. Reynolds is it Wide Mouth Willie or is it what? Is it is loose something lips? Like, loose lips. I think oh, it's loose, loose lips. lips. Sorry, loose Ryan Reynolds, yeah. you're serving Hi. us poutine. Okay, so let's try this. All right, thank you. Because we're going to have to thank you. you very much. For me. Okay. Yep. You can try too if you oh, want. Oh, I'd love to try. Yeah, of course. It. Yeah. Right, well, here you go. Here. You, you okay that. with carbs? Um, I'm uh, <laughs> occasionally. Uh, okay. I am from Montreal, so this is, uh, this I'm no stranger is, yeah. to oh, poutine. Mm -hmm. like Don't the, eat the, the Canadian, Canadian flag. flag. Don't eat the mm -hmm. flag. But now you know this one's Canadian. Mm -hmm. This is how you get oh, like really communion good. at church in Montreal. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's really Hot good. Okay, so this is going to be versing an Australian dish. Okay, I'm not I'm not judging yet. No, we can't we judge yet. This is really good. Okay, oh, it's no, the no. you no, no. Oh, what? my God. You G'day, it? everybody. I'm going to bring you some Aussie classics. Oh, my gosh. And what do you have for us? That's my Jackson? accent. That's my accent. That's so very I've been working on it so hard. amazing. Oh my, my, my dialect coach is okay, Chris you know Hemsworth. I'm going to spin this around. So yeah, there, that's there you great. Go. Oh, yeah. And you're good with space. I hate to say it. Hugh Jackman. But my snacks are bigger. That was really good. It was really good. Yeah, that's going to be tough to be I love poutine. Do you? I like poutine. 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 What is it? Pronounce Wolver what? Yeah, Wolverine. 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 I was going with a French wine. Wolverine. 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 So this is um, the Aussie meat pie. Yeah, what are we yeah. Let's just dive in, but I want to try some, pie. Pie. Yeah. Okay. some of that too. Here, okay. you guys. This is called a meat pie. So basically, pastry meat. These look really kind of fancy and really, really well done. Thank mm -hmm. you. Okay. And in Australia, the meat pies, you want some sort of undisclosed meat in there. You want stuff in there. Oh, so really, you yes. want the mystery? You want a little bit of mystery. Okay. Oh, mm -hmm. look, I fingernail, found the little meat. few things like that. Oh man. Oh god. Oh, you can oh, really taste the. Wait, 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 whoa, whoa. Oh, wait, we're oh, supposed to put yeah. something on it. Ah. It's not ketchup. You've got to have tomato sauce on it. A little bit of tomato sauce, tomato and if you want to, yeah. Tomato sauce. Man. Tomato, tomato sauce. Pinky up or Yeah, down. and you have to eat the flag. That's oh, edible. How wonderful. <laughs> That's what I'm yeah, okay. go for it, Ryan. You okay, can really taste so. the recently Wait. deceased drips. Sorry, you can't. Oh, guys, <laughs> this is what we eat. This is our hot dog. So this is what, it? well, what? you're meant to take it out. No, 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 no. Yeah, that's about really? it. No. But normally you take it out and you eat it like that at I'm a game. Ready. So you have so this at a game a of football. Heart. Wait, do you know that, oh. was that accidental? What? Yeah, what? I feel like Look. we need a close-up of that. Look at that. A little heart? That oh. represents like the heart. affection between Deadpool and Wolverine. You see it? Wolverine. Wolverine. Okay, our job, Sean, I've got these paddles for us. it's judging time? So we have to vote. But before you vote, can I just say,
say this is, feels like an away game. Like, I'm not, you know, everyone... I, I'm okay, respect, I but these are gonna... Australian classic being... Perfect, exactly. It is an away yeah, game. Because yeah, yeah. you have being three Canadians. Canadians. I know. Yeah, I know. Saying. We are not I going to, to be it. just voting Canadian, though, are we, Sean? <gasps> okay. Whoa, no, that's, that's a real man-sized man. bite. That's that. not TV. There you go. There you go. Okay. That guy lifts heavy. Uh, guys, we have so move? much to eat. Okay, I'm ready so we to gotta vote. move along. Okay, in three, two, one. Mm. Oh, I'm so yes. sorry. Wow. Poutine wins. 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 That's fun. But that's I actually want to say, yes. that's one of the best meat pies I've ever had in my life. Isn't so good? No, seriously. That is. Jason Scrub, our shout out. Where are you? Jason? Yes. Oh, my God. Meat pies to every Australian. It was the time. Every Aussie is going to come flooding for that. That's actually got meat in it. I don't taste any, like, toenails, nothing. Jason, do you want to come back to New York and have a better life with us? Yes. Uh, okay, next up, everybody. I will pay more, just to be clear. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, Actually, it's fine. I live in his actually, house. Yeah. Yeah. So it's fine. fighting yeah. over your food, as they should. I know yeah. we're so lucky to have him. Okay, let's this do is gonna the be next great. We have three hours, right? Uh -huh. That's good. right. Butter tart versus pavlova. Yeah. Okay, okay Ryan, sell mm. us on the butter oh, tart. I love them both. Well, this no. is a quintessential, which is just a fun, it rolls right off the tongue, quintessential Canadian treat here. It's um, The filling consists of maple syrup, of course, brown sugar, uh, eggs, mm -hmm. you know, cooked. Let's try uh, while well, yeah. explain. Oh, well, yeah. The, yeah. the tart really is, is uh, you know, the tart, so I'm just off the top of my head here. The tart <laughs> uh, consists of short, crusty pastry. Mm. Uh, big debate among Canadians. Mm. Raising, raisins or no raisins? I'm a no raisin. Mm -mm. What no are you? Raisin. Yeah. Are you no raisins too? No, no I, do, I do love oh, that's butter sure. tart. That's no. good stuff. Yeah, mm. so like a... Any time of day. Mm. Mince pie made sticky toffee pudding. This has been mm. around since uh, it was developed. It was developed in, in uh, 1900 in Ontario, a in bit Ontario. like Hugh Jackman, <laughs> uh, who uh, yeah. Okay, so that, that is the first that time is, played Wolverine. Mm. Wolverine. That is actually great. I'm going for a second bite. Good, right? Okay, the pavlova. Okay. Pavlova, pavlova time. time. Now pavlova. I'm, I want you guys to try. This is up until about three years ago considered an Aussie classic. It has now been deemed officially New Zealand. So if you guys, huh? if you guys Wait, prefer what, really? yours more, yeah. Oh. Why, why, why did it go why, to New why Zealand? The switch? Uh, thank you for asking. Mm -hmm. So, the Russian ballerina Pavlova yeah. in the early 1900s came, did a big tour, I think 1900s. That's very good. Went to New Zealand, apparently had this dessert, loved it so much. She came to Australia and said, I don't know what this thing is. I had this thing, could someone cook it? So, she described it, and someone said, and made it, so everyone thought, oh, it's an Australian thing, and they called it Pavlova after her, but actually it's been a big debate for a hundred... Are you, have I lost you all? I, I, I have to play. That is not on any card. I, I know this stuff. I, I actually... Knowledge. I really am Australian. Okay. How are you? You know so many things. I know. I actually really am Australian. Even though... <laughs> well, okay, let's talk about three, mm -hmm. two, two, one. one. Win. Come on. Oh! So New Zealand. Zealand. That was good. Okay. Yeah, I'm I want to get to as much as we can. Okay, okay. we have the okay. Nanaimo. Nanaimo. Okay. okay. Brian I'm going Reynolds for a second it. bite of that. Okay, really... I know it's really good. Nanaimo Ooh. versus Fairy Bread Lamington. Sure. Hugh, do mm -hmm. you want to start? I'll start. I've never had one of these before. Okay. Okay. <laughs> no, this is actually, this is a mashup, right, Chase? Mm -hmm. This is a mashup of two things. Fairy bread, like a classic kids thing. White bread, think, picture Wonder Bread. You have Wonder mm -hmm. Bread Could here you just grab them with your hand, yeah. right, Hugh? Oh, wow. Yeah, we, white we, bread we with... I, we didn't have Wonder Bread when I was a kid in Canada. So we just think yeah, the whitest... White bread, not The whitest bread possible, cut off the crust, a lot of butter, and then these things, which we call hundreds and thousands. What do you call this? Sprinkles? Sprinkles. Yeah. yeah. Hundreds of thousands. Because you're putting sprinkles. Because you're putting hundreds of thousands on, on your piece of bread and that's it. But this is a lamington, which oh, is man, like a good. like a coconut, like a chocolate cake, a bit of coconut oh, sponge, man. whatever. It's wow. a bit of both. Okay. That's a, Nanaimo. Yeah. That's a what do we do here? Commitment. That is really a sprinkle commitment. Mm, there's so much. There's so many. Um, Sorry, no. Jace. You really gotta separate your fairy bread from your lamington. That's two <laughs> delicacies. Jeez. That's just like that's just a lot. That's like that's oh. like a threesome. It's too much information. <laughs> you can cut all that out. So okay. much knowledge. You can cut so all that out. Now's when we let the Canadian talk. Who okay. put a nickel in you today? <laughs> I just had so much sugar. And I can feel oh, Sean going. This poor man has not no, had I sugar in six oh, years. Oh, yeah, that's room. fair. He's been training yeah. to play Wolverine. I feel like it was a freaky Gross. Friday yeah. today. He's me and uh, I'm him. <laughs> Okay, Nanaimo. All right, we're gonna go into the Nanaimo bar. Oh, dude, yeah. here we go. Uh, all right, let me see here. Uh, the this Nanaimo bar, awesome. well, okay, Nanaimo's a, a, a town in uh, Vancouver Island, which is where my brother uh, is a uh, Mountie and uh, has lived there for a long time. His address you. is, um, okay. Uh, yeah, so uh, the, these, uh, the, these I love Nanaimo bars. I've always loved them. Um, they originated in 1950s. Mm -hmm. um, they're three layers mm -hmm. of graham cracker, cocoa powder, walnuts, coconut. Mm. And then custard icing in the middle, and Ooh. it's a layer of ganache on top. And a little Actually, salt, a uh, little salt, yeah, Jason. Good, right? Is there any sugar in that? It's hard to tell. <laughs> no, none, none, none. Are you feeling uh, it through your body? Uh, oh, oh, wow. Yes. Well, okay, we we all collapse. 
No okay. sugar. Ooh, this one's a tough one for me. Well, okay, yeah. three, two, one. Oh boy! Oh, oh things nice. are getting uncomfortable now. Okay. Hundreds and th uh, really? Yeah. Let's do smoked meat, Montreal oh, meat yeah. versus barbecue, oh. Australian barbecue. Oh. Hugh, do you want to start? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, Aussie barbecue. Okay, there well, we go. Uh, we're sort of known for our barbecues. This is like I've got sausages here, and I got oh wow, I got shrimp. <laughs> Remember when Paul Hogan did the shrimp, put a shrimp on the barbie, did that? No, yeah. yeah, but yeah. he really wrecked it for you guys, didn't he? Everyone in Australia really was angry because no mm. one knew what a shrimp was. And we're like, what the hell's Paul Hogan talking about shrimp? Yeah. Like, it's a prawn, mate. Put a prawn on the <laughs> yeah, barbie. Yeah, right. It's right. Prawn. Okay. Anyway, grab a prawn, whatever is your jam. Either a sausage, I do prawn. Want that okay. sauce. There's yeah, no tomato sauce. You've got to have tomato sauce. Did anybody one ever challenge Paul Hogan sauce, on that? Guys. We've got tomato sauce. Uh, doesn't anyone else want to know the more? end of that story? Yeah. Sauce with this dip sauce. your sauce. Also needs what tomato sauce. It's not a so sausage, it's a sauce. Dip your sauce in the tomato sauce. A hot? God almighty. I do like that. that. And the shrimp. No. Did you get eight hours sleep last night? What's going on? <laughs> I'm a big bite, I just I'm just... What do you call this thing? I'm just, this yeah, is just, just like going. intravenously into my veins. <laughs> what about Montreal smoked meat? That's, oh man, that's really good. good. I'm, I'm gonna have that. two. Yeah, oh, that's good. Mm. Yeah. 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 Say goodbye to everyone, Jason, your last day here. Good, amazing. <laughs> but you had a good run here in Toronto. Yeah, oh, so good. yeah really good run. Um, what do you, do you wanna sell us he on was, that one? Oh yeah, I do. Oh, yeah. There's so much happening over there. Pastrami, I probably, of the meat, this to me is the most frightening, but, it is huge in Canada um, and elsewhere. Uh, it's a type of kosher style deli meat. Mm -hmm. uh, it's made by uh, salting and curing beef brisket with spices invented in the early 1900s. Everything is in the Everything 1900s. happened in the early 1900s. Yeah. What a um, great decade. Here you, you try go. that. Who doesn't love a little... Uh, oh, no. You got in there. I, I think just you two. Okay. Uh -huh. I'm, 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 I'm getting, getting I'm the getting, like, yeah. this is like Usually a with rye miracle. bread, yeah. Oh, and it's so thick. You're oh. going to get the meat sweats uh, now, which is another fun... Uh, I'm just going to unlock my jaw. It's a borderline psychedelic. So, so this is a Canadian thing? Like, mm -hmm. Oh, no. Oh, pastrami. Montreal. I remember first mm -hmm. discovering that in New York, a pastrami and rye, but that's it. No, no, this is not pastrami. I'm from Montreal. Smoke meat, big in Montreal. Okay. Really big. And for purists like myself, Better in pastrami. Let, less okay. so in, in West Coast, like yep. Vancouver. You okay. want. Are we both? Voting, okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. In three, two, one. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh okay. Okay, cool. And this, this says a lot because I love me some smoked meat. Yeah, and I but love this. Barbie. That was what, good. What was this called? Sausage. 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 I like this also. Okay, this but we have to drink bangers, something. Bangers, yeah, we have to drink. Let's wash it down, gentlemen. I need a drink. I need a drink. We actually have. Does anyone want a Caesar? Yes, 100%. Okay, um, this is going to be the Caesar versus the yeah. lemon, lime, and bitters. Nolsey, you want to go first, mate? Uh, yeah, I'll go. I don't okay. mind. That's, That's my nickname, by the way, Nolsey. <laughs> um, you know, okay, so the Caesar was invented in 1969 by a restaurant manager in Calgary. Uh, that's an Alberta cue. Uh, you don't drink a Caesar as much as you savor it. I will die on this hill. Uh, in the only, not in the Australia, but if, if you, the U.S. was, you know, in this competition, right. they'd be talking to Bloody Mary here. But like, no. And when you tell someone from America. You put clam juice in something. Yeah, they shut down. Oh, they shut right down. Shut it yeah. down. And they judge you. I'm yeah, kind of with them. I'm uh, feeling judged. Right you down. Yeah. And they and they, they arm up because they're American. They're crazy. <laughs> uh, so you, you don't want uh, yeah, yeah. For this, the clam juice is everything. Should we try it while you're yes, yeah. please. Sorry, I could yeah, Thank I should have done that I'll first. Pass down. Oh, oh, God. Oh, oh you I never have one. You anywhere, Nolsey. Okay, and then this one actually has uh, I'm going one aviation one. gin in it. Oh, uh, wow. not, oh, not sure. doing an ad. But Can we this get a tight shot uh, on this, please? Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. aviation, uh, American gin. This is the Deadpool edition uh, bottle of aviation, American gin. Okay. Uh, <laughs> all right. Yeah. Sorry, you guys don't carry those on you at all times? <laughs> mm. um, and what do you, you got? Hughes, okay. what do you got? Undecided about that drink. What mm. about you? What do you have for us? Uh, mm. No, I'm decided. Not my jam. Oh, okay. Really? I love oh, wow. Canada. You're just well, loving it. No, 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 no. I, I, you're, not, you're not part I'm of not the voting. Tomato tomato juice. Will you no, drink, I'm not. Do you drink a Bloody Mary? We can't vote. Not really. I don't drink a Bloody Mary. I'm doing this Hang on. Okay. Okay. I'm giving you guys, this is really, I'm actually learning something today. This really is a lemon lime one. bitters, yeah. which is, it says here, a lot of people have it after a game of golf, which is actually the only time I ever have it, but I didn't know it was Australian. 1980s. Um, Ooh, something apparently happened in the 80s. It was, And so it's lemon, lime, and bitters. What else? Oh, no, I'm reading the barbecue. It doesn't matter. <laughs> um, <laughs> so try this. I actually didn't even know this was alcoholic. Oh, this so, is good. Oh, that's maybe, I like that. Uh, that's why I got pulled oh, over by the cops. I think we've shown our hands. Right? Uh, I think yeah, we can go right really to good. the boat. Do you think? I think so. Oh, I don't, sorry. I don't know. Okay, I'm let's build suspense. Wait, build three, suspense. two, one. <sighs> Wait, you okay. going? 
I Caesar? gotta go Caesar. Wow. Such a well, it depends on what, what time of day we're drinking, right? Oh, because yeah. I feel like morning. either way, this is an 11 a.m. So, so, both of these can be an 11 a.m. pickled bean. All right, it's a tie. It's a tie. All the things. I'm holding up a sign that says tie. Oh, it is a tie. I don't know if it's an to be wearing a tie or that we just. Okay, it's a tie. It's a tie. This whole thing is rigged. The entire thing is rigged. In Australia, would they say tie or a draw? Uh, oh, interesting. Draw. Mm -hmm. It's a draw. a draw. How do we say cheers, everybody? Just cheers. There it is. Yeah. Cheers. 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 Thank mine. you, everybody, for cheers. doing this. This was a lot of fun. Thank you. 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 Thank you.